hey there so we have to learn how do we extract text from an image using the OCR engine right so how do I extract the text so this is one of the example you can see this is a PNG file or a text uh, image file and we have got couple of text and let me show you the demo of extracting the text out of an image so I've already built a workflow which I'm going to teach you in some time and let me run this first and show you how it's going to do the job so I'm keeping this in the background all right you can see it has taken the data it has taken that image and I'm expecting the workflow to extract the text out of this image okay looks like it is done let me go back go to the output and the output you can see how nicely it has extracted the required text from an image okay so for this I have used the Google OCR engine so let's see how it works all right so to do this uh, the very first thing that you require is to have an image file so how do you get such an image so let me tell you it's quite easy all you do go to Google and let's say we are learning about get OCR text right so type that in Google go to docs.uipath.com open this portal so on this portal I have option to um, you know take a screenshot of couple of text and probably work on that one so that's quite easy right so that is quite possible for all of us to do that so let's wait for the page to load and once that is done all I have to do is take the snipping tool click on new and you can you know select any text of your choice um, and you can save this particular file okay so I have already done that I have already done that and saved it so I don't want to repeat this but this would be a easiest way for you to save a text so I have saved the text when I click on this text what happens this text is uh, opening on my browser uh, this particular image is opening on my browser you can see it's a PNG uh, kind of an image so with this I am going to build a workflow so for that all I have to do is we have a pre-built activity called get text OCR with the OCR engine all I have to do is I have to drag and drop that activity sorry get OCR text get OCR text instead of get text OCR okay so once you have this text all you need to do is indicate on screen and ensure you have opened that specific PNG file and you are highlighting it so it could open in any of the um, uh, maybe on paint you can open maybe on a browser you can open up to you so once you have opened all you have to do is highlight that specific data or that specific image once that is done uh, on the right hand side you have this output called text so here you go ahead and create a variable so let me create a variable um, control plus K and you can do output okay any variable you want to give a name so once the variable is created all I want to do is utilize a engine so what happens there will be multiple engines if you type OCR you will see there are multiple engines available okay for such activities either you can go with Microsoft OCR or you can go with a uh, test rack OCR which is a Google OCR engine so depending on the need and sometimes it might fail so if it is failing for you it's not working then go with the alternative available ones okay so here I'm going with test rack one Google or Microsoft OCR so test rack is nothing but your Google OCR so I'm going with test rack OCR so you have to do a, a hit and trial okay which one works for you just try that and a couple of other things would ask you for an API key okay for example if you go with Google Cloud that ask for an API key which you may not have so Tesseract is one of the free engine which you can utilize okay so I'm using Tesseract that is done now all I need to do is use a log message activity log message or message activity anything you need so I'll go with a log message and all I have to do is select info and here in the message property I have to go with output as the variable okay that's all so while you run this remember once you hit on the run button ensure you go back and keep it in the background otherwise you can utilize open browser open application you can open that image you can write a couple of more activities in case you want to do everything on automatically but here our goal is to learn how it works right so I did not do the entire workflow you can design it that's up to you all I'm doing I will run this particular workflow 
keep this in the background and wait for the workflow to start working on this image so give it give it few minutes so you can see it has taken that image and from this image i'm just waiting for it to complete so it has completed let me go to the output and you can see i am able to extract all the text from an image so this is how you will scrape the data using ocr engine so there are so many ocr engines all you do uh, give a little time to drag and drop all these ocr engines instead of test rack you can go with microsoft ocr and alternatively try to see if you could get the text out of that image all right so this is the technique guys thank you for watching you guys have a great day